But they're going to take off a midfield player who's really been almost a second striker, hasn't he? He's put so much into the attacking side of his play, and no wonder he's a bit tired. Yes, yeah, certainly uh, covered the ground, hasn't he? Getting forward, and that's his trademark, but he's also got back to help those defensive midfielders as well. And the keeper can collect this one. And here, it's the goalkeeper's ball. Opposing defender probably said to him, go on, shoot, to actually know he hadn't got the technique to bury it from that distance. No, and uh, he had options left and right as well, so what a poor decision. Coming up now, a corner, the ball's just deflected behind for that. No apologies for focusing on this fellow. He's got that ability to find space within shooting distance and he's done it really well today and, and found the back of the net too. And the corner, the shot's on! Back, back off the post! That's great defending there, stopping that attack. And the goalkeeper plunged to make the save. That's a fine shot, an even better save. Yeah, he would have been disappointed to get beaten, but nevertheless had to keep his eye on the ball. deserved a bit better from it yeah he's one of the best headers of the ball in this league I then you think it must go in but it didn't go in well it was manna from heaven for any striker but I think he's taken his eye off the ball there well Chelsea have been trying to get a player in of his capabilities for some time and they've now been able to get their man well, 35 million or thereabouts isn't a small figure, but uh, loads of potential with this lad. And it's Celtic on the attack. Comes in with a tackle. Cummins. Davidson, he's got it back again from his teammate. Goal news from Inverness. It's a goal for Inverness, Caledonian Thistle. Free kick awarded against Celtic. Well, that's a yellow card. Yeah, I don't think there's any choice there from the ref. Good play until they got that challenge in. Celtic looking really to click into the attacking side of their game now. Good defending. Challenges for the ball. Cummins. Still 20 minutes to go. You see a substitute coming on for the away team here. Well, they're in there challenging each other. 
That's a shame, because he is tired. He's getting on the ball, but it's a big effort from it. Well, he's got support here. And here's the shot. And he's put it in for the goal. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special. And he is feeling that special delight at the moment. Well, I want to see this again, this goal. given them a comfortable situation here, 3-0, as the game gets underway. Ten minutes left of regular time. Here's a goal from elsewhere, Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Kilmarnock. Eight minutes remain, 1-1. Thanks, Alan. Patrick Van Arnholt. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Shot up! A well saved! Shot's on here. Over the bar and the chance is gone. forward with some danger and shoots a let off for the defending team it's over the bar Uh, groaning really those who are backing him to maybe get one of the, the goals of his life I don't think he'll ever score from that distance well, I think his manager might just have a little word with him at the end of this match At times you thought they got a bit greedy, but why not? I mean, if you're on top of an opponent like they were here today, rub it in. Well, they did. They were ruthless, weren't they? They rubbed their faces into the dirt. And um, it is the hallmark of the top side. Good this move. This with a chance to go into the lead now. Spotted that well and intercepted. Attacking well here. He's got his shot off now.
Celtic. And here comes the counter-attack. He's had a go here. He's kept it out. And the goalkeeper plunged to make the save. Support here. And here's the shot. And he's put it in for the goal. 